Hey, uh, just going to fly through Saturday morning's uh, session with you. Okay, so pretty straightforward stuff in the mobility. Uh, so first thing is just a frog stretch. Okay, so frog stretch coming down, getting those knees nice and wide. Okay, feet resting on your incep. Okay, heel directly behind. Okay, my uh, knee and then pointing those toes up towards me. Coming down onto your forearms, keeping that back nice and straight, and then from there I'm just going to try and sit my hips back as far back towards my heels as I can. Hold in that position for 45 seconds to a minute. Then we're going to go into our pigeon stretch. Okay, so pigeon stretch, leg out in front, just let that leg collapse out to the side. Okay, extending that back leg behind, keep your back, chest up back nice and straight, and then lower your chest. So not collapsing over to the side and then just folding over. Okay, again, 45 seconds to a minute on each side with that. And then our last thing is just our pull aparts and dislocates. Okay, so pull aparts, we'll know. So we're starting at eye level, pulling across the chest to chest level. So back eye level to chest level, squeezing those shoulder blades together at the back. You'll do 10 on that. And then we will do 10 dislocates. So nice straight arm, overhand grip all the way over and back, trying to narrow that grip in as best you can. Is that okay? So 10 on the pull up press, 10 on the dislocates. We'll do all of that, okay, for three rounds. Then after that, Mekong. It is two rounds for time. Okay, so you've got uh, 50 lunges, you've got 40 squats, you've got 30 burpees, you've got 20 dips, and you've got 10 push-ups. Okay, so you'll do all of that and then we will do it all again. So it is two rounds, okay, for a time of 50 lunges, 40 squats, 30 burpees, 20 dips, and 10 push-ups. So our lunges, if you have space to do them, you can do them walking lunges, we can do them forward lunges, or we can do them reverse lunges. Completely up to you. This is body weight, okay? So stepping back, always making sure we have to stand up tall, bring our two feet together, then alternating left, right, or we can go forward, okay, or we can do walking if you have the space. Once you have the 50 of those done, it is into 40 body weight squats, okay, so 40 body weight squats, okay, getting into our squat stance, all the way right down, okay, making sure we're going right down. So a lot of the time we start seeing people when they're doing metcons and doing body weights and they know they have to go really fast and it's all of a sudden, it's this sort of thing where they're just hunching over. Still concentrate on getting good depth into your squat and standing back up, keeping that back nice and straight all the time. Is that okay? So you will do 40 squats. Then, I suppose the hardest part maybe, perhaps for some people, is gonna be 30 burpees. Okay, so it is chest to floor, all right, straight arm or off an elevated platform. We all know our burpees at this stage. You will do 30 of those. Then it is into 20 dips. Okay, so with our dips, remember it is hands resting on something behind. Okay, so again, I'll just bring the movable chair in, okay, for this one. So it is hands resting, okay, on our chair. Straight legs if we can, okay, bent legs if we find them a little bit too difficult with foot flat on the ground. Keeping your back nice and close to the chair or table, whatever it is you're using. Okay, so walking out bending that elbow, bringing down to about 90 degrees and driving all the way back up. Don't allow your hips to kind of sink and collapse down. We always want to keep them elevated the whole way through the movement as well. So that is 20 dips. And then you're going to finish off around with 10 push-ups. So remember push-ups, elbows nice and tucked in. Okay, hands directly below my shoulders, full extension in and out. So if you imagine I'm doing them off an elevated platform there, okay, we don't want this starting to happen. Okay, my bum is miles up in the air. Okay, or I'm bringing my chest down to, or I'm bringing my stomach down to the bar, wherever it might be. So they all need to look the same. That's how you're gonna progress best, okay? So elbows nice and tucked in, bringing chest to floor, chest to bar, whatever it might be. Is that okay? So, and there's 10 push-ups, best version you can do. Once you've done all that done, then we're gonna repeat all of that again. Okay, so it is two rounds. So 50 lunges, 40 squats, 30 burpees, 20 dips, and 10 push-ups. Okay, best way to approach this, guys, is 
just split it all up, okay? Don't be kind of thinking to yourself, okay, God, 50 lunges, okay? Or whatever it might be, or 30 squat uh, burpees, okay? Split them up into 10s, get 10 lunges done. Step out, take it, give yourself 10, 10 seconds or so, then go back and complete another 10. Same with the squats, same with the burpees. Even if the burpees, you might have to split them up into five. Do five, give yourself a couple of seconds, okay? Go back and do five, give yourself a couple of seconds and do them that way. Is that okay? So don't be kind of seeing the big number, okay? And just kind of going, oh, oh my God, I'm still low. got 28 to go, or still 25 to go, whatever it might be. Just give yourself small little targets to reach that overall goal, all right? So it is two rounds of 50 lunges, 40 squats, 30 burpees, 20 dips and 10 push-ups. That's it, guys. I will talk to you on...